take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Many credit card issuers have policies against sellers charging a credit card account before shipment. If you think a seller charged your account too soon, report it to the credit card issuer. Otherwise, the issuer has no way to know the seller isn't following its policies. Let's help you make your mark. Your account will be charged when the order enters the shipping process. If you pay with a credit card and the item you order is sold by Amazon.com or one of our merchant partners, we won't charge you until the order enters the shipping process. Make your mark, take our lead. If the seller does not click, ship, the order status will show as awaiting seller to ship until the indicated shipping time has passed. If the time lapses without the seller shipping the item, the order will automatically be canceled and the buyer will receive a full refund. Make your mark, take our lead. How to dispute your charges for non-delivery. Step 1. Contact the seller. Reach out to the seller and try to resolve the problem with them directly first. Step 2. File a dispute with your credit card company. Unless you paid via PayPal, then jump down to the PayPal dispute section below. The 24th of February 2016. Take our lead. The time that it takes for a merchant who accepts a credit card as payment until the time the funds are deposited into the merchant's bank account can vary depending on the type of merchant account the business owner uses. Typically, a payment can take anywhere from 24 hours up to 3 days to process the payment. Take our lead. Number two, as others have said, if after processing the system determines that you have several orders pending in the queue, it will charge your card only when the items ship. However, if it is a single item and customer shipment is generated based on the best logistics possible and your card is automatically charged. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.